Hi everybody, welcome back to Sacred Body Studio. My name is Fabi and we're gonna do again other variation of the salutations. So are you ready? So let's start. We come at the top of the mat. We relax our shoulders, drop your hands beside your body. Close your eyes just for a few seconds. Feel how is your hips, is your hips is tilting backwards. So we're just going to kind of pull the pubic bone towards your belly button to engage your tummy muscles to allow us to keep our pelvis more in neutral. Soft your knees and press your feet against the floor. Make sure that you have that sensation of press your feet against the ground to give us a stability and engage the leg muscles without pushing your knees backwards. We keep our tummy in, lift our chest bone, relax our shoulders. We take four deep breaths just to really keep us into the present moment. Inhale deep through your nose and exhale through your nose. Let's go for three and exhale. Let's go for two and exhale. And just one more. Open your eyes. And we're going to start. So remember that the last variations we were spine rolling. So we were down and up with our back curve. Now we're going to try to hinge from the hips and keeping our back straight. So we're going to bring our hands on our hips. Inhale, lift your chest bone. Exhale, bend your knees to allow us to hinge forward and your back remain straight. All the way until your shoulders reach your hips high. We go forward bend. We can bend the legs to reach the ground. Drop the hands. And we're going to repeat this part a couple of times. So hands on your hips. Straight your back. Lift the chest. Inhale. And exhale. Drop your hands. Forward bend. Inhale. Chest come up. Straight your back. And exhale, forward bend, drop your hands. Remember, keep your legs bent as much as you need it to don't feel pain at the back of your legs. Again, inhale, chest come up, hands on your hips. Exhale, hands go down. And one more, we'll repeat this four times. Inhale, and exhale. Inhale, we straight our back, chest up, keeping your hands on the ground. We can bend the legs. And we're going to step backwards, right and left. Here we're going to repeat another four exercises. But it's, it's just the same exercise, sorry, but we repeat it four times. So what we're going to do, we're going to move our shoulders forward, bend, uh, bend our elbows tiny, and then push ourselves up all the way onto child pose. And again, all fours, shoulders forward, bend the elbows tiny, feel the tricep muscle strength, and tilt backwards, child pose. Remember, pushing your bum down into your heels as far as you can. Let's go one more time. Forward, elbows bend, chest down as far as you can go. You really need to feel it strong at the back of the arm, and back again. And just the last one. Forward, bend your elbows, and push yourself back. Back again, on to all fours, and we're going to repeat this one. We're going to move shoulders, move the shoulders forward, elbows bend as far as you can go without opening your elbows, and then just drop the pelvis and lift your chest and arch your back. Now bend your elbows, engage your tummy, let the chest go down onto the ground. Bring your arms to the front, forehead on the ground, and we're just going to inhale and exhale. We bend the right leg, flex your foot, and release. And let's go right, left, and right. So you can go right again. Flex your foot when it's, the leg is bent. And the left. Two on each side, right, and left, and 
one more in each side, right, down, left, down. Drop your hands beside your chest, push your body up onto all fours, all the way, child pose. Take a deep breath, inhale, and exhale. Back onto all fours, curl the toes under, downward dog, remember this posture. We're going to inhale, exhale, right leg up and down. For four, down. For three, down, push through your fingertips on the ground, two, and the last one. We swap the legs, four. Three, two, one more. Look to the front, walk with your legs forward, bend your knees, chest go down, inhale, straighten your back, hands on your hips, come all the way up. Super. So it's pretty much the same exercises, and this time we're going to hold four times in some of them. So let's go together to go all the flow, because you already are familiar with some of the exercises, and now it's easier to go together. So let's go. Come at the top of your mat. Hands on your hips. Inhale. And exhale forward. And all the way. Drop your hands. You can keep your palms facing up. Inhale, straight your back, hands on your hips. Exhale, forward bend. Keep your legs slightly bent. Don't force too much your legs. Muscle. Inhale, come up. And exhale, forward bend. Come up for three. And release. And the last one. And release. Inhale, straight your back, hands on the ground, step power right and left. So we move our shoulders forward, elbows bend as far as we can, push ourselves up all the way, child pose. One more time, all fours, move our shoulders forward, elbows bend. Come up, you don't have to go too low, as low as you maintain your elbows in. Let's go for two more. Shoulder forward, elbows bend, push yourself all the way, child pose. Just one more. Shoulders forward, elbows bend, push up, and downward, and child pose, sorry. One more time, but this time. Shoulders forward, bend your elbows as lower as you can, and then you just slide your knees, drop your hips, lift your chest. Bend your elbows, lie down on your tummy, extend your arms to the front. Inhale, exhale, right leg bend, flex your right foot, release down. Left, and right, and left. And right and left and down, right down, left down. Drag your hands close to your chest, push yourself all fours, all the way, child pose. Take a deep breath, inhale and exhale. Back onto all fours, curl the toes under, lift your knees to downward dogs. Inhale, exhale, right leg come up. And let's go for three. And two. And down. And just one more. And down. Left leg up. And down. Three and two down, 
just one more and down look to the front walk with your legs so you can step big and walk a little bit forward bend inhale straight your back hands on your hips come all the way up you can bend your knees to you don't strain your legs again inhale and exhale back straight and fall forward Drop the hands, pulse facing up if you prefer. Inhale, chest up, straight your back, hands on your hips. Exhale, fall forward. Keep your tummy in all the time. Let's go up for three and release down. Two, engage your tummy, press your feet down and down. Just one more. And now straight your back to a step backward, right and left. We go for the strength and beginning of Chaturanga. Shoulders forward, elbows in, elbows bent. Push yourself and child pose. Again, shoulders forward, elbows bent, chest down. Come up and child. One more time, shoulders forward, elbows in, chest down, come up, and back. And just one more. Come up, shoulders forward, elbows in, chest up, and back. One more, just to go forward. Elbows bend, chest down as far as you can, then you slide your knees backwards, drop your hips, lift your chest, bend your elbows, chest go down, extend your arms to the front, inhale and exhale, bend the right leg, flex your foot, and release, left, and release, right, and release, left. close to your chest, push yourself up, keep your tummy in, all the way, child pose as much as you can bring your bone down onto your heels, keep chin and chest to release your neck. Back onto all fours, curl the toes under, downward dog, and inhale, exhale, right leg come up, four, three, two, One, left leg, four, three, two, one. Look to the front, step forward, right, left, or we can walk. Bend your knees, let the chest touch your thighs. Inhale, straight your back, hands on your hips. Come all the way up. Good, how it feels. Let's keep going. Inhale, exhale, back straight, all the way. Drop your hands. Inhale, chest up, straight your back, hands on your hips. Exhale, forward bend. And up for three. And down. Two and one more and that you can slide your hands on your legs. You really feel a nice sensation of release. Head up, hands on the ground, step backward, right, left. This is more about the strength. Shoulders forward, elbows bend, push yourself up all the way. Again, shoulders forward, elbows bent, push yourself, and back. One 
back onto all fours, shoulder forward, else bend, else bend, push up, sitting back. And the last one. Come up, move your shoulders forward, elbows bend, push yourself up and back again. And anytime when you repeat more days, you might have more strength and you can be a little bit more lower. Back onto all fours. Shoulders forward, elbows bend, lie down by dropping your pelvis, lifting your chest, sorry, <laughs> and relax. Now here you can push yourself backwards to allow your head to stay on the mat. Extend your arms to the front, and we just go inhale, exhale, bend your right leg, flex your foot, and release. Left, and right. And left and right and left and right down left down. Grab your hands beside your chest, push your body up all the way, child pose. Back onto all fours, curl the toes under, downward dog, we do the legs lift. Inhale, exhale, right leg up, and three, and two, and down, one more, and left, and three, and two and down one and down walk or step forward let the chest drop inhale straight your back come all the way up this time I add the arms hands back for a position and drop them beside you let's go for the last one okay ready inhale hands on your hips Exhale forward, all the way. Inhale, hands on your hips, straight your back. Exhale forward, bend. Again, three and two and. One more, and inhale, straight your back, step forward, right, left, and we go. Shoulders, bend the elbows, push yourself, child pose. Okay, shoulders, bend your elbows, push yourself, and back. Again, shoulders, bend your elbows, push up and back. Just one more. Shoulders, bend your elbows, push up and backwards. Come all the way up. Now we go shoulders forward, elbows bend as far as we can go and then drop your pelvis. Lift your chest, elbows in, shoulders down. Bend your elbows, lie on your tummy, you can push yourself backwards, that's always I do just to keep my face on the mat. And we just go inhale, exhale, bend the right leg, flex the right foot, and release. Left, give you deep breath all the time. Right, exhale, and inhale down. Left. Your hands close to your chest, push your body up onto all fours, 
Sitting back onto child pose, take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale. Back onto all fours. Back onto downward dog. And we just go with the leg. Right leg up and three and two and down one more and down left and up and down two and down and last and down look to the front you can make a big step wherever your hands are or you can walk forward bend Straighten your back, hands on your hips, or you can lift them forward all the way up and drop your hands middle of the chest and beside your body. Roll your shoulders backwards, everybody. Shake your body how you feel. Good, there's a lot of blood coming in and out, in, up and down into our brain. Breathing, connecting with the movement to help us to release our tension in the muscles, but also to stimulate the lymphatic system and the endocrine system. So I hope you are fine with this series, and I hope that you are doing like a seven days, like a, you take one variation and do it seven days. If you already are watching this video, give it a go. Give it seven days, like every day you do it, it just takes you a few minutes. Of course, you have the other variations that you can still practice in. You will feel different your mobility, your well-being, oxygenation. It's going to be just completely different, different way to feel yourself. And again, you can do it in the morning, which is great, but also you can do it in the evening or nighttime. Thank you for joining us, and we we'll see you in the next video.